You know, the relationship with my mother, um, you know, is, is you know, is, is probably one of the most important things in me. Um, and, you know, people don't know what my mother had to go through, um, you know, to get me to camps, to, to get me in a position to where I am now. Um, you know, she, she's been through so much, um, had to be a strong woman. And, you know, I respect her forever for it. Um, she, she went a lot without um, for me to have. Um, you know, and I've always noticed that, so I was never the kid to ask for much, um, you know, besides when the season came, you know, I always wanted, you know, a pair of gloves and cleats, you know, different things like that, but, you know, I, I, I knew that, you know, she didn't have too much, um, you know, so I would ask for a video game here and there, you know, what kid didn't, right? But um, I never asked for much, man, and she was, she was, she would always be there, you know, no matter what, you know, she's at all, all my practices, uh, she never missed a game. Um, from Little League to now, she never missed one. Not one game she's missed, and you know, actually one game, you know, I thought that her and my dad missed. Um, you know, I didn't think I seen them there. And then after the game, I was like, where was y'all at? You know, and and then they, you know, they called me. And they was like, well, we was there. We was just hiding, just trying to see how you did. But us not there. Um, it's crazy because that she. You know, we, I'm from Wisconsin, so they used to come to the practices all the time. And then the head coach, you know, Coach Beelan was just like, hey, like, you know, your parents got to chill out a little bit with the practices. Like, they come in too much, you know, and you know, it was just it was just crazy because, you know, they, you know, we had scrimmages or something like that, and they'll be the only parents there. And she'll be up there screaming for everybody, you know, and it is just crazy, man. It's a wonderful sight to see because, you know, not many kids, you know, had that. So, you know, you can't take it for granted. Very fortunate, um, you know, and I love my mother always for, you know, what she's been through and, uh, you know, for definitely giving me and, and making me the man I am today. I need an edge. Hey, go out of y'all boys. I got to get up. Huh? Yeah, they said this one better. Six it is. Glory Clement College. That's my young hey. boy. Hey. You can get 28. Hey! Hey! What's that, Chief? What does that mean? It means lock and load. I don't even fucking care about it. you beat me, bro. I just want to finish. You just want to finish? I just want to finish, bro. Daddy, hey, I just want to finish. If I finish this lap in 20 minutes, I'm going to be proud of myself. You feel me? I'm a competitor. I'm a competitor. I'm a competitor. I had him trying to switch cars in the middle of the day. I don't know what he was talking about. Man, I'm five. You know my nickname in here, Ricky Bobby, right? Always in the big truck. In the truck, you me. Where you get your shit toe up? You feel me? You're the perfect timing. You feel me? Rich, chewy too. You got the, you got the inside down there. Yeah. <laughs> What do I like to do for fun? Wow, I like to obviously play video games. I love to bowl, man. That is my thing. I, you know, I go, you know, my girl, I will go miniature golfing or something. You know, she, you know, she pretty competitive, uh, you know, and uh, man, I like, I like doing a lot of stuff, but bowling is my thing. Bowling, bowling, and, and uh, I like playing basketball a little bit. I'm not really good, but. I like playing, but bowling and video games is like my little hobby. Um, you know, uh, my rookie year, um, it was like, you know, a tough year for me. And in my second year, I was like, man, I'm going I'm to find some things to do, you know, for myself to, you know, when, I'm, when I feel like I'm struggling, just, you know, I'm, I'm my stress reliever. And, you know, me and my buddy, Noe, we would just go to, you know, Kearney Mesa. 
and we would just go bowl. You know, me, him, and Kenzel, we just go bowl all the time. You know, we end up getting our own bowling balls, man. Just having fun with it. And I just think it's just, it's super cool. First, it's cool because when you have a, a whole bunch of friends, what are the first thing people want to do? Oh, let's go bowling, you know? And so I was like, okay. So it'd be sober, it should be super dope to at least get good. So if I can win, I can talk trash and I don't, you know, I don't look weak. Um, but second, I just use it as a stress reliever, man. I just love to bowl, you know? I wish, I was trying to join a bowling league actually, but you have to be there year round and I knew, you know, that'd be tough. But bowling and, and, and playing video games is my thing, man. Other than that, I like to chill.